Hi there, Internet! I'm Polar the Polar Bear, and this is my girlfriend, Melissa. Hello! Welcome to an episode of Fast Food where we are trying what, as far as we know, is a brand new, like, not even advertised on television product from Taco Bell. Yeah, we were there tonight uh, to get some water because we were, we've been exercising and doing stuff. Yes, we and, have. And, uh, so we went to go get water, and we both literally, like, I shouted into the drive through speaker what and then he <laughs> turned around and went what <laughs> um so yeah it's the um and we'll make sure we have the correct name in the title but it's the we believe the beefy cheesy crunch core burrito yes something like crunchy that. core something yeah, like that we'll burrito. have the correct name in the title it's, for this what, though what it is is it's got uh it's a burrito and it's got um uh beef and rice on the outside and sour cream i think and so there's some sour cream yeah. in there too, and um, on the inside there's a, like another tortilla with like nacho cheese sauce and little crunchy uh, Frito pieces. Yes, and we also tried the spicy one, so we'll spicy be posting one. that video, which yes. is uh, I think our most train wrecky video. Yes, absolutely. Date. Like we're more together on this one, yes. but that one we couldn't even. So I've got a lot of editing to do on it. Yeah, but um, yeah, I think we're excited to try it, and uh, we got it at Taco Bell. It was two nineteen. Uh, which it's a pretty dense, heavy burrito, so um, <laughs> so yeah, the value I think is pretty good. And I would agree. With, I think two nineteen is a good, good decent. Price yeah, it's pretty burrito. densely packed, so I'm I'm not feeling like we were gypped in that regard. And God willing, again, it's like a brand spanking new product. But if I can find the nutrition info, it will be in the description down below. Yeah. I'm sure you can. If for some reason we can't, we'll try and post edit, you know, post it as an, like an addendum one. It does become available. I bit down on that. And the cheese like shot into my throat. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> I'm not going to get that experience. <laughs> <laughs> of all the things that could just shoot down your throat. <laughs> cheese is the one you want. It is. Yes. <laughs> just a little throwback to our... Uh, extreme sausage innuendos from filming sausages earlier. My turn. And the spotted dick episode. Thank you. Oh my god. So, this is a historic moment for me. Because you don't even like the Fritos. Because I don't like the Fritos normally, but I actually think they pair really well with the rest of the taste profile of that burrito. There's like no more cheese though. It's in there. It's in there, yeah. Don't you, don't you worry, don't you worry, Chav. It's in there. Um, I want cheese to shoot down my throat. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll go get, we'll go get another one at some point. You can have the first bite. Yeah. Um, to have that cheese in throat experience. Um, again, I don't even normally like the taste of those Frito pieces, but it really works with that particular burrito. And, uh, I'm... And this is a huge surprise to me. I thought that, like, by far the jalapeno one was going to take home the uh, the prize. But uh, I'm actually going to give that a good, like, pretty high seven. Oh. Um, and I, I'd recommend that one. Even, yeah. even more than the jalapeno one, surprisingly. Yeah. That's weird because it's, like, a cheese and jalapeno core. You think, like... That's, that's like perfect. Our, that's our thing, too. Like, like we, we love... love cheese and jalapeno together. And so, like... I think, I think what it is is that the... The jalapeno was kind of poorly distributed. And the cheese really just got lost in the burrito. Right. So if you, um, I think if you cut up, like if you diced the jalapeno and distributed it evenly throughout the cheese core, rather than just having yeah. like big pieces here and there, it would yeah. have been perfect. Honestly, even this one, the cheese gets kind of lost for me. I didn't, yeah, no, I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't get the cheese really either, but what I got was the Frito pieces. But the Frito which, is nice, yeah. yeah. So, I mean, yeah, I think the burritos could definitely have more cheese. It's kind of like the quesaritos, like, um, I don't know if because they're all individually made by hand, but, like, sometimes I'd get a quesarito and I'd be like... I'm not getting any cheese out of this. Yeah. Um, so I think each, it's kind of... Each person makes them differently and, like, yeah. you know, they, they make them, you know, if, if it's, like, late, maybe they're tired and they yeah. mess them up so or I'm whatever. Not, like. I don't necessarily think that that's, like, a deterrent, but I do... That's, like, the one thing I wish consistently for both of these is that there was more cheese. Like, I want, like, a cheese gush in, like, every other bite, every, you know? Yeah. And I, I wish the cheese had a little bit strong... Like, okay, you know what? And, and I, I know this will never happen because Taco Bell has cruelly 
cruelly taken this sauce from us. Oh, yeah. But if it had a lava sauce core rather than just nacho cheese, I think that would be perfect. We'd be all over the <laughs> Yes. Like, oh my God. we like, would buy, like, a hundred of those. That would be... You'd just, like, are... Like, some legal individual would be like, uh, have to inform you that uh, Melissa and Polar have both died yeah. of massive coronaries. I mean, basically, we'd buy all, all of the burritos, and then we'd probably, like, make snow angels in them. Yes, and then um, we'd, like, and, and, you know, we'd mortgage everything we own. Yeah. So, you know. We'd, we'd have to sell Lenny into yeah, cat slavery. Cat slavery. <laughs> I mean, obviously. I mean, he'd have to go work in, like, the meowing mines. <laughs> he is very cute, by the way. He is very cute. On the yes. ground, just chilling. It's hot as balls here. Oh, it's so hot. It's I mean, still, it's still like 83 and it's almost 10. And the house 10. is kind of stuffy because we were out for a while. Yeah. So. Um, I didn't get my rating. No. You gave a 7. I gave a 7. Um, I, I do recommend. I'm just going to give it a 6 because this is basically just the beefy crunch burrito, which I like, but this is more expensive. So, I don't know. If, it, there were, if the cheese were there better... I think I'd like it. A stronger um, flavored cheese. Honestly, I think I'd like the jalapeno one the most if the cheese were more prominent and the jalapeno were more prominent. Like if there was more, you know? Yeah. Um, I, but, I can see that. Um, I do like it. Um, I just don't... I think if I were going to go back for another one, I'd go back to the jalapeno one, honestly. Um, so Sur I'm going to give this... Surprisingly, I'd go back for that Yeah. One. I'm going to give this, though, a, a six. Um, I mean, I think it's pretty good. Um, and I'm... I, you know, I say... I probably won't go back, but I very well could. It's yummy. Like, I'm, it's good food. So. Who knows? And we, we live very close to a Taco Bell, so, like, we get Taco yeah. Bell fairly frequently. Um, so, yeah, I think it's good. And I'd say go get it, especially if you like the Fritos, because they are prom a prominent flavor. So, um, but even if you don't, which you don't, I don't good. Know, like, so even it, if you don't, maybe try it. It blends well. I, what yeah. can I say? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I mean, it's a brand new product, so, and it might not be around forever, so as with anything that we try that's like that, I think we always, even if we really don't like we it, we always... normally say, like, go try it if it sounds interesting, because, yeah. you know, you might decide so, later and you want to and it's gone. Exactly. So I think that recommendation is still there, like, even though maybe I might not go back and buy it, like, it, it's, if it's limited time, I think I always encourage it, people to go try it's, it. Unless it's, like, stupid or really expensive, like that Boss quesadilla thing they were doing yeah, for that a while. Was stupid. That was stupid. It was yeah. just, like, a $5 quesadilla with, like, 10% yeah. more meat. This is good, though. If you like the Beefy Crunch Burrito, um, if, you, if you're a fan of that, which it comes back occasionally, um, you'll dig this burrito. It's pretty similar. I think the Beefy Crunch Burrito is still on the menu. Is it? I think so. I think it's on their value menu. I could be wrong. I think so, though. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Yeah. Could be. I don't know. I could be wrong, too. I don't... I, yeah, I honestly don't know. If I'm <laughs> wrong, correct me if you know what I'm talking about, but I'm just not talking about it properly. Please correct me. Um, because my brain is... Oh, my brain is mush. We're both super tired. We're tired, and it's hot, and, like, I don't... I, I'm hungry... I don't function in heat yeah, either at all. Yeah, and I don't function when I'm hungry. Um, so, you know, the pair of us together, we're just derping our way <laughs> through the day. <laughs> so, we hope you've enjoyed our couple of derpy uh, late night yeah. reviews here. Sorry, and, guys. <laughs> uh, we, uh, we hope to see you all again uh, very, very soon.